The Abington case began when Edward Skimp, a Unitarian Universalist, a resident of Abington Township, Pennsylvania, filed a suit against Abington School District in the United States District Court for the Eastern District of Pennsylvania to prohibit the enforcement of Pennsylvania state law that required his children, specifically Ellery Skimp, to hear and sometimes read portions of the Bible as part of their public school education. That law required that at least ten verses from the Holy Bible be read without comment and at the opening of each public school on each school day. Skimp specifically con contended that the statute violated his and his family's rights under the First and Fourteenth Amendments, the first which protects the freedom of religion, speech, and the press, and as well as the right to assemble and petition the government. And Fourteenth, which defines citizenship, contains the privileges or immunities clause and due process clause, and the equal protection clause, and deals with post-Civil War issues. The district court ruled that Skimp, in Skimp's favor and struck down the Pennsylvania statute. The school district appealed the ruling, and while that appeal was pending, the Pennsylvania legislature amended that the statute to allow children to be excused from the exercise upon the written request of their parents. This change did not satisfy Skimp, however, and he continued his action against the school district, charging that the amendment of the law did not change its nature as an un unconstitutional establishment of religion. Due to the change in the law, the Supreme Court had responded to the school district's appeal by vacating the first ruling and remanding the case back to the district court. The district court again found in favor of Skimp.